Co-productions uh, usually start with the general director uh, and uh, with, uh, with an idea for a, uh, for a production. And a co-production generally allows you to build something that's a, a little more than a, than a company can handle on its own. Uh, so if you would have uh, one uh, additional producer or two or three, or as in the case of the Porgy and Bess that we have coming up, uh, there were originally, I think, five or maybe six co-producers on that. Uh, and uh, the Turandot that we've done over the years uh, was a co-production. And it was uh, Dallas and Miami and Washington, D.C., San Francisco, Houston and uh, and one other company, which means you can invest more uh, in uh, in the uh, in the product itself. You can invest more in the design. Uh, you can also use heavier materials to make it uh, stronger, make it last longer, because you have to remember that after every performance, after every production, these pieces all have to be disassembled, put in trucks, and move on to the next city. So it it, it isn't like putting up uh, uh, some scenery in your local high school doing the performance and then throwing the scenery away. The, these things have to last a, a great deal, uh, a, a number of years. 